Hey everybody, it's Newtaf here. Uh, I do a lot of live streaming, um, where obviously I'm doing live commentary, but uh, I put up a few YouTube videos of, of fights that are recorded offline, and uh, they didn't have any commentary or anything. So I'm thinking of trying trying this out, see if it sounds good, how it works out. Um, this is my big weapons build, we're invading Cyan Nox here. My big weapons build, which is near and dear to my heart, combined with a uh, hidden weapon, uh, also near and dear to my heart the love of my Dark Souls life, as it were. So here we're just uh, kind of feeling each other out a little bit. Just throwing out a few swings for no particular purpose. And doesn't really do very much. Eventually we got to close that gap, right? There, he blocks that one nicely. Oh, but not too much, uh, too nicely there. I don't know if you meant to do that back step or what. Maybe you didn't realize just how far the reach is. So I went for the jump attack there because just before I saw him kind of running up confidently and thought he might be looking for a parry, so I went for it. That, uh, he probably wasn't expecting that. Uh, I don't really know what he was going for there, maybe a backstab, maybe a side poke, one way or the other. Uh, I guess I turned more than he expected to, expecting me to. Hmm. summoning somebody. And I'm facing this direction and surprise! It's Peeve. Oh, double surprise! It's from behind. Whoops. Yeah, I forgot the Dragon Bros always invade from that uh, spawn point, not from where their uh, sign was. So I was looking towards where I had summoned him from. Oops. Come on, dog. Really? I'm recording. Oh, and at this point he, he's asking me for like some green blossoms or something and I'm like, dude, let's fight. He's like, no man, give me some green blossoms. And so here I am, looking for some green blossoms. Oh, surprise, they're, ah, oh, they're equipped on my hotbar. And at this point, he's like, ah, whatever, let's just fight. You can see him dancing a little bit in the background there. All right, fine, we'll fight. Nah, I guess we'll fight. Oh, and then I go and rebuff my weapon, because I'm being a dork. Man, this fight's a mess. Because his P, of course, he runs up and tries to parry you first, first thing off the bat. I should, I should just start punishing that and just jump attack the first thing that he does. That would be great. Teach him to stop doing that. He's doing a lot of these like crazy flip things with this build. Ooh, partial there. Very close, very close. He almost had me. Comes in more of these uh, little flippy-doos. Here, because I'm way off beat. I got a grass there. He has like almost no reach though. See, I turn around all the way because I was worried about a parry. And uh, seeing him parry there, I didn't expect him to do a second parry, so I went for the hit. Luckily that paid off. Parry, parry, jump around. And here comes the infamous bow. Oh, and he switches and goes for the parry. I'm not going to fall for that one, Peeve. Come on, man. I know you better than that. I fell for that once. The first time. Never again. Somehow he rolls, rolls through that. That looked like a, a hit that probably should have gotten him. Usually those the, the length of this weapon works out for that. That was just a silly, silly jump attack. I shouldn't have even tried it. I must have expected him to try and go up for a parry or something. And here I am, having turned away completely for the uh, unlocked hit, was still facing backwards at the point where he runs up <laughs> and accidentally hits me. And, and now you can see him. He, he wants a nice fair fight, so he, he wants me to get a free hit here to, to compensate for the backstab. That, that's beef for you. I probably wouldn't have bothered, but I'll, I'll take it. N nice fair fight. Now I'm going to get some serious salt in my comments for, for talking about fairness and backstabs. You know what, guys? Just can it. <laughs> it was a nice finish there. I went for a jump. He caught me mid-jump. If I had managed to land that, it would have been all over. But, that's how it goes with the slow weapons, you know? Okay, okay. Oh, look at this guy. Prize Fury, man. This guy's a Mr. Cool Guy over here. Attacking on the spawn. Yeah, he's, even though he's rocking a crystal ring shield, which I, I can respect that. Seriously underpowered. Going straight for the hits. Here we go. This is the counter, back, uh, counter backstab parry. Bait him into thinking that he's got a backstab. Flip out the parry. 
throw that Lloyd just in case. And that's for attacking at spawn. Come on, man. Let's have a nice good fight. There's no need for this. Here you have me uh, hiding in my little corner where I can buff my weapon in peace. Alex, 22 Mac. I fought this guy. Oh, a girl probably, right? Alex Mac, right? From the Nickelodeon show. Am I right? Am I remembering this? So, could be a girl. I fought... Well, let's assume it's a girl. I fought her several times before. She's very good. Or at least pretty good. I, I know I've lost a number of times. Not that that's really indicative of anything. There's that hidden weapon going to work. Not pro not entirely sure what I had, probably. Didn't exp uh, anticipate the length. Ran right on up. I'll well, see that one. I was just barely off. My aim was just barely off. If I had unlocked, I might have made it. Well, there's me unlocking to try and compensate, but no good. We trade there. That's okay. That's a decent trade. I think I got the better of it. Nope, no good. Rolled on past. I'm getting a little jumpy here. Maybe a little too jumpy. Yeah. Oh, anticipated the parry, missed the aim on the jump attack. Too bad. See there, that was nice. Managed to catch the long range thing. Oh man, that was close. Got the partial. Well, I got the parry, but took damage from it. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. That would have been. That would have been almost all my health, if not all my health, if Alex had landed that. I got a little bit lucky there. That was kind of predictable at the end. This guy looks familiar. Is that Cyan Knox again? Who dis? Yep, Cyan Knox again. Hide in my corner. Buff my weapon. Hey! Where'd he go? Hey! Oh, there he is. Hello, up there. Hello! Point to the stars. I guess he wants me to fight somebody. Is that a claw? Looks like claws, right? You know, it looks like a parrying dagger or target shield or something. Doing a little flippy do. Now you guys remember Demon Souls with that crazy was that parry was it a parrying dagger? Everybody would do that silly dance all over the place with that weird sound effect. <laughs> so, so here we wait. It's a professional quality video here, folks. Waiting for the invasion. Well that guy does random moves up there. Quiet dog, it's gonna be okay. No, nope. guess the summoning failed. Bow for having a good fight earlier. Now he's uh, given away my weapon. Well, I, mean, I guess he knows what weapon I've got anyway, having fought me just a few minutes before. Oh, bow, watch out. What I want more than anything, ah, oh, is to punish that bow attack like that. It d didn't work out. I like, the, I, I respect the claw. I respect that quite a bit. Not terribly easy to use. Ooh, went in for the parry. Caught a partial. Broke the guard. Got to watch out for that. I, d I don't know. I don't remember during the fight whether I recognized that I'd uh, gotten partialed there. I keep, I keep going back. I'm doing like the same thing. But I'm keeping it at distance. Ooh, God, that was close. That, like, the running up to your face in the middle of an attack, of big, especially the big weapons, and doing, going for the parry, and thinking you have the timing right, I respect that a lot. I, I certainly don't do very much of that. You know, I'm, be, I'm being kind of uh, jumpy, trying to get out of the way. Oh, look at that. He rolls out again. Oh, turns away at the last minute. There, there's me trying to correct that. It's nice of him not to hit while buffing. It's kind of a gentleman's agreement anyway, you know? Dangerously low on stamina. Now yeah, we're good now. The double hit from the claws, that was good. Oh, so close. So close. Go for the unlocked hit as he rolls by. He's a little bit too far, I think. I think at this point, probably in my mind, I'm starting to look for a jump attack. I'm, I'm betting. Ooh. Probably 
any time now, I'm probably going to pull out a, a crazy jump attack. It's going to lose it for me. That's too bad. Too bad that didn't hit. The aim was pretty good. I guess he rolled through it. What is he... Now, now what's he doing? Some weirdo flips. Oh, you even heard the sound from it, but nothing. He rolls up, gets a hit, rolls away, all through my attack animation. That's just crazy stuff. Look at that. Runs up to my face. Gets the parry. Like a boss. Well done. Well done, sir. Respect. Here we go. Buff our weapon in, in privacy. Oh, Alex Mac again. Hello. All right. Let's look, look for a fight. Look for a good fight. Come, come, let's fight. Hooray! Maybe that was a, a missed gesture. I'm not sure. And about three gestures, you guys. This is a three gesture fight. High class. Looking for that parry. Ah, I should have known. Look at that. The confidence. Walking in with confidence. I should have known. Should have known. Should have punished with a jump. Could have gone for a backstab there, I think. I think if Alex wanted. Could have. Whiff, whiff. We're all whiffing. He's going for a hit. See, a lot of other players would take two hits there and ca catch me on the second one. Ah! Oh, was blocking for that. Managed to get her shield up in time to block the jump, which I rightly used. Yeah, see, a lot of a lot of players would do two hits there, and they catch me on the second one definitely. Ooh, and there's a hit. That's okay. I shouldn't have buffed like that. No worries. No worries. Let's let's play on, and the bow respect. See, I love these players who have, have this kind of respect for the duel. I know that there's no rules around this kind of stuff, but, you know, it's just a nice gesture. It's like playing against friends, even though you don't really know these people necessarily all that well. God, the parry. See, exactly the same happened with that, uh, thing happened with Alex last time. Got the parry, but took the damage. That time, that time it worked out. That time she wasn't uh, super low on health. Bad on my part. Not reading that. Sometimes I get careless with uh, those rolling attacks. People, I think I've become a little bit predictable. Zartful Dodger. I fought you before at some point, but I don't really remember how it went. Hello, from way up here where I'm safe. No, there's nothing wrong with that. I don't, I don't trust people either. Oh, pulling out some magic. There's nothing I want more right now than to jump attack punish one of those, but I don't think it's going to happen in this fight. So what is that on the other? It's probably a balder. Balder side sword. Because the soul arrows are very, very scary. Here we go, another cast. No. I have to keep staying away. See? He's using the cast to try and lure me in for something else. And and if he happens to hit me with the cast, hey, even better. Oh, managed just to like get all the way around me. Managed to get in and get out without taking a hit there. Finally, finally. Actually, that looked a little bit weird because two hits caught up with him. And it's like one of my previous hits caught up with him. Doesn't matter. Managed to land one of those lucky soul arrows when I'm while I'm not paying enough attention. And that's it. You know, one of those things probably, probably over half my health. I got about 1500 HP. Easily top half my health. Here's my alternate location for uh, hiding and buffing when the, the phantom is going to be summoned over there. Here we have the core. This guy. Spoiler alert, guys. This fight is not pretty. I 
I, I don't know if it's lag or what, but I am unable to hit this guy, and he's able to hit me very badly. Look at that. Rolls right through, gets the backstab. At least I get away from the fireball, thank god. This is, this is spades training. Getting away from spades. Look at that range. That range is ridiculous. I think there's probably a little bit of lag in play here. That was that was fair. A good jump to finish it off. But god, the range on that, that scythe? That was kind of crazy. Anyway, well done. That was good. Oh, looks like I switched to Great Club for this fight. Wonder why. Oh, here we've got another Peeve. I think it's because uh, we fought Peeve before and wanted to switch it up. We? What was that? Royal Wii? No, I. Here we go. Time for spamming rolling R1, right? Both types were, Look at this like weird back and forth. <laughs> you gotta be... I gotta be very careful about getting... See, that was a clear backstab opportunity. Just a little bit too far for that. And he manages to roll away from the, the regular hit. That, that's so parryable. So it's so easily read and so parryable. Come on, Peeve, come on. Ooh, that I felt like that should have hit him. And look at that poise. He's got some poise there to take that on the way out. Oh, pancake. Eleven hundred damage on the pancake. I traded, but probably worth it. Probably worth it for me. See, that felt like it should have hit. It looked like he was still in the middle of a uh, attack. There's a lot of like kind of back and forth. There's an ebb and flow to this this fight, definitely. As with most fights, I suppose. I'm probably starting to look for another jump attack around here somewhere. Oh, the, no, running running attack. Turning my back like that. Backstab fodder if the other, if the other person recognizes it. I don't even <laughs> I think I was expecting him to go somewhere. Ah, I'd love to get in there for that hit. Just a little bit too far. Just a little bit too far. Three rounds for this fight. Things are looking bad for me, but if I can manage to get one solid hit, it might it might put him over the edge. A jump attack would be even better. Well, look at this. Oh no! Oh, that's zero poise working against him. I've got that that Kirk armor. And it's exactly like last fight. Or very close to like last fight. I go for the hit. He manages to hit me out in the middle of the animation. That's slow weapons for you versus fast. Well done, Peeve. Good fight. Well, that's all we got. Um, so I'll probably put up some more hidden weapon invasions at some point. Hidden weapon uh, big weapon invasions at some point. Um, but until then, thanks for watching. See you guys later.